Hey everyone! In this tutorial, I will show you how to make this dress with the pleated bodice detail, cutouts, and a full circle skirt. My fabric is from digitalfabrics.com and you can use this site to do custom printing in almost any type of fabric which is super cool. They also have prints you can choose from and I'll have the link to my fabric in the description bar. So the first thing that I'm going to do is make the circle skirt. So first I fold the fabric in half and then fold it in half again and these two sides that I'm measuring will be the same measurement. Then you have to find out your waist measurement, add 2 inches for seam allowance and divide that by 6.28 and that will give you the circle radius. Then add half an inch seam allowance. Use that measurement to cut out the first quarter circle. Now you can make the outer circle using whatever measurement, like so. Now cut a straight line on one part of the skirt. For the bodice, I just traced a regular bodice pattern and made different style lines on it. Then I traced those individual pieces on a new piece of paper and added seam allowance on it. For the pleated piece, I just made horizontal lines on one of the patterns, cut each rectangle out, and put paper between each piece, so when it becomes pleated, it will look like the original pattern. So you will see that I use this method for a couple of the pieces in this dress. Then I will just cut everything out. On the fabric, I will make little notches on where the pleats end and start so I know where to fold them. I will keep the folds down with pins and then sew all around it with the sewing machine. Now I'm going to sew the backing along the neckline. So this dress will be clean finished from the inside so a lot of these pieces are cut in doubles. So now I'm just attaching the side panels. Now I'm turning these pieces inside out and then attaching the side seams. So I will do these steps for the other side of the dress and then attach the shoulder seams together. So I did the same pleated detail on the sleeves and I will attach it to the dress like so.
Now I will attach the bodice to the skirt. Then I will attach the invisible zipper and hem any raw edges. And we're done! Thank you so much for watching, I hope you enjoyed this video. Shout out to digitalfabrics.com for this fabric. I really like the quality and I really like how my dress came out, so definitely check them out. Bye!